Hey guys, Doggy Sugi here. Gonna be doing some bingo on North America's version of Lost Saga and see if we can get the Azazel or whatever it's called. I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, but yeah, let's jump right into it and try to get this thing. So, bingo card. Grab my bingo card. Probably grab all my change numbers right now. Or draw numbers. Buy 100 and hope for the best, which is probably not gonna be the best, but we'll see how it goes. Alright, use. Start the game. All right, so gen pet, no clue what that does. Uh, so let's uh, start the prize changing. We got some left over from last time, luckily. All right, rare hero scroll. Uh, what is this? Idol petty, no clue. Uh, epic idol boy package. Okay, I guess it's a BTS. Probably get sued the crap out of if you name it BTS in this game. <laughs> a strider. Uh, idle pet F. Upgrade five time 100%. That's pretty good. That's actually a pretty good package. Idle pet A. Omen gear set. Is this like, um. What would this be? Is this the, uh, Azazel thing? I'm just wondering, what is that? Because that sounds kind of cool. I want to see what that is, but I don't want to use all my things on it. I want to get Azazel, first of all. Stranger. Uh, Mark Metal, Lion Paladin, Epic Engineer, I don't know if I actually have that, I'm not sure if I have that, I could use that, but eh, stat reset ticket, full stat reset, that's actually, that's actually decent, but then you gotta spend like a fortune. To build up your skills again with ZP and or GP or whatever it's called, I still I still call it paces myself. All right, Star Child Pet, almost out of prize changers, Uriel, and Mark Metal. So we need more uh, prize changers here. All right, special prize change. We'll go ahead and buy 20 right now. So I think I started with like 97k ZP. So let's see if we can get Azazel with that money. I'm not going to add additional funds. Uh, that should be enough, hopefully. <laughs> but if it's not, you know, we're going to have to just, just uh, be lucked out on Azazel and wait for an opportunity to get him down in the future. Epic Dark Lord package. Uriel gear set. Premium Hero Scroll. Perm Legendary. Matador. What? A Matador? It's an interesting prize. You don't even see that character. <laughs> Poison Assassin. Uh, Predator Package. Stat Reset Ticket. Gin Pet. Perm hero package. Premium. No luck so far, guys. Hot summer. Hot summer metal, I guess. What is this? Def K metal. Idle pet E. Come on now. Come on now. Five time upgrade. Okay, this is Azazil gear package. Do I want to do this? Do I want to do this package? No, I gotta save it for Azazel. I'm not gonna worry about the gear package. I've gotta get him. Uh, Nightmare, and last one for Prize Changer. Idle Pet C, so. Maybe they'll wrap me in and give me him and then I won't have enough, enough draw numbers to get him. So I'll buy another 20 Prize Changers because I imagine it's not gonna happen in 10. All right. The gamble there is like, um, am I going to need like 50? Am I going to be wasting my time? <laughs> Down 77k ZP. Still plenty of time to work with. Oh my gosh, I got I got to change Patriot from dancing here. This is this is going to drive me crazy. All right, shut up, Patriot. Shut up, please stop. Oh my God, no. All right, tell you what, we're going to go to HQ to get rid of that sound effect. <laughs> I can't take that. I can't take that. I, I, I could mute my uh, sound, 
but then you guys would hear it because I think it's still recording my sound. I can mute the sound on this, but that's no fun. Alright. So I, that kind of got me flustered a little bit. Alright, here we go. Back to it. Stranger. Premium Hero. Idle Pet A. Mark Metal. Totally not interested in metal packages, by the way. Striker package. Very lag sensitive package. Cool character, but very lag sensitive. Omen gear. I still want to know what that Omen gear set is. Very curious. Ah, this is him. Yes, we got him, guys. We got him. All right, perfect. Perfect. Let's start the draw. I'm going to develop my carpal tunnel here by rapidly clicking this. It would be nice if you could redeem like 10 numbers at a time. I think that would be a lot more efficient in terms of the functionality of the game. And we're actually getting through this board pretty quickly, so that's kind of nice. Alright, come on, come on. And we're down to about 7. About 6. About 5. So I tell you what, I'm actually going to buy another 99 and work with that, because, you know, uh, if we do get it on 99, um, that'll be better because we can try for another package afterwards. I'd like to see what that Omen gear set is, actually. Right, so we'll buy this, because buying um, guaranteed slots, like six of those, is just going to be just as much. So I'll gamble with this. Alright, here we go. And just like that, we've already gotten down to four. Down to three, down to one. Let's see if the gamble pays off. You know what, I might buy the guaranteed number for this one uh, because it is one number and we can end up losing a lot of those uh, draw numbers. So we'll go ahead and use the 2,000 on that. Seems reasonable now, seems reasonable. Bum, ba, ba, ba. All right. Let's see what we get next. Uh, starts. I want to use my price changers to get something cool before we go into checking out how Azazel functions. Because I never got a hold of him on the on the Korean server when I was uh, logging in. Because it's a unique character. I never get unique characters. Give me something cool to price change to. Come on. Give me that Omen gear set. Poison Assassin. Uh <laughs> Like, yeah, go figure. I get them twice within, like, ten price changers. That figures. All right. Let's check them out here. <laughs> awesome. All right, receive. I'll go ahead and receive this other stuff, too, while I'm at it. Money, female. Should we make him female? Make a Zazel female. Where is he? There he is. All right, that's kind of cool. We'll fly that. All right. Get the clovers and stuff, too. Alright, that should be good. Let's go into HQ and check him out. That should be cool. <laughs> That's one of my favorite characters, though. Unicorn Lancer Evo. actually have a video upcoming for that. Uh, yeah, it was, a, it was an amazing time playing Unicorn Lancer. Wait, this isn't... What is this? This is Hacker. What the heck am I doing with Hacker? Alright, there's my Azazel. I was like, what the heck? I didn't realize I had Hacker. Alright, here we go. Has a double jump. One, two, three, four. Faint. Jump cancels off the faint. Does he? Does she lift off the faint here? What the heck? All right. So apparently it hits like low to the ground. All right. Interesting. Interesting. Let's try a full combo. Wow, that's a long air string, huh? All right. Let's see what the passive does. Alright, chains to the to you. Does it expire eventually or what's what's the what's the purpose of that? Alright, let's see if we can uh Okay, that didn't work out like I was thinking it would. Hold D. Okay, so like if you hold D again after. Alright, you dash attack after that. You know the dash attack seems like it's a bounce down. You can air dasher. That's kind of... Oh, that air dasher is nice. Oh, that's nice. I like that. 
I wonder if there's like a follow-up to that. Doesn't seem like there's a good follow-up. I'd have to review like the unique video to see what she does off follow-ups. One, two, three, four. Ah, that didn't work. So maybe I do it on a third attack. No feints off that. That is interesting. I like that. Can she double dash? That is so quick though. Yeah, there's like no follow-up. There's like no double hit when it comes to that. It's not like a true half faint or anything. Um, try the air hold D version. Oh, so when she jumps, holds jump after doing that. It teleports on them and swaps position. Okay, that's interesting. So if I um, if I do this, <clears throat> that apparently didn't work too well like I thought it would. Okay, if I hold lightly. Okay, there's like a max range, I think. All right, let's try this again. All right, that's interesting though. Uh, so if I get him near the edge, let's see if that'll work any better. Okay, that's cool. That's a good, easy way to get rid of someone who's uh, tied up as a prisoner. I like it. All right, let's see if we can get an actual... Does this lift off grounded? Oh, it pulls in off grounded. Okay, so you can extend your combo a good little bit. Uh, does it hit, hit grounded? That's the question. No, it does not. Okay. So theoretically, you could do that. Pull them in. Why did it not pull in? Huh. So if they're facing their back to you, it pushes away, it looks like. But if you are facing them, no, it still pushes away. Maybe it depends on where the angle you hit them at. Okay, I don't, I don't know about that. Let me try to do this like an error thing. Okay, so you could combo like that by swapping positions. How did I get them to drag into me, though? Okay, so if you put them facing like that... That faces away, so if you get them to the other angle, it'll pull them in. Wherever the gargoyle's, like, facing, I guess. That's what matters. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, that didn't work too well. I'm sure there's like ideal combo videos and stuff out there that there you could look up. Uh, okay. Oh, that is cool. Okay, I like that. You can angle that in the air. Just pull them in. I like it. I like it. I'm sure there's like more nuances behind the character. Let's look at the weapon skills and stuff. Oh, yeah, I'm sure that's a joy to deal with. I like the effect, the green glowing... Uh, burning effect. That's cool. Yeah, these gears look super annoying, though. <laughs> Alright, what does this do? Oh, no, it, it, la it left me. Flame Barrage Q? Do I not have this bound? Yeah, this would be annoying to deal with, too. I don't have that bound to my controller anymore. That's strange. Let me try this uh, helmet skill. So it charges up to 33. Okay, and it like... Does that lock skills? It looks like it locks skills. That's interesting. Teleports and attacks nearby opponents. Huh. Why did that lock skills? Yeah, it does lock skills, so you can't get out of this real easy. Shoot, I feel like I should have marked him before I did anything there. Let's try this like this. Alright. So yeah, you could do that marking... Yeah, the thing goes away if you go max distance. Otherwise, not bad. Okay. I'm sure there's some really interesting combos with Azazel. But yeah, glad we got it. Glad we got it. Might make a video here soon, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the bingo video, and I do thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you next time. Give me the taunt. Give me the taunt. There we go.